Have you ever garbaged down enough food to trank a girthy buffalo and then fretted that you've botched your diet? Have you ever skipped a workout or two or five because of injury, travel, or reasons best known to the dreadlord Cthulhu and then despaired that you have derailed your progress? Have you ever wanted to just pack it in because despite your best efforts in the kitchen and gym, you felt like you're trying to swim upstream in a river of jello? Of course you have. We all have. And here's the thing. None of that actually matters because you can make every mistake imaginable without screwing this fitness thing up. That's right. You can blow past your calories time and again without blowing it. You can miss scores of workouts without wrecking it. You can stray through the sunless streets of slump town without spoiling it. In short, you can fail over and over in fitness and still succeed. How? The only way to lose at this game is to strike your flag, to give up. That is the big secret. No matter how many times you tumble off the wagon, so long as you clamber back onto it and clatter onward, you can't mess this up. Because fitness is not a contest with winners and losers. There are no deadlines or duels or distinctions or demerits. Fitness is like love laughter, learning. It is a wellspring of health and happiness to pursue purely for its own sake. Fitness isn't fleeting. It is forever. So spit out the saccharine fruits of short-termism and delight in the realization that you have all of the time you need to find your feet and your abs. All right. Well, that's it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it and found it interesting and helpful. And if you did and you don't mind doing me a favor, please do leave a quick review on iTunes or wherever you're listening to me from in whichever app you're listening to me in, because that not only convinces people that they should check out the show, it also increases search visibility and thus it helps more people find their way to me and learn how to get fitter, leaner, stronger, healthier, and happier as well. And of course, if you want to be notified when the next episode goes live, then simply subscribe to the podcast and you won't miss out on any new stuff. And if you didn't like something about the show, please do shoot me an email at mike at muscleforlife.com, just muscle, F-O-R, life.com, and share your thoughts on how I can do this better. I read everything myself and I'm always looking or constructive feedback, even if it is criticism. I'm open to it. And of course, you can email me if you have positive feedback as well, or if you have questions really relating to anything that you think I could help you with, definitely send me an email. That is the best way to get a hold of me, mike at muscleforlife.com. And that's it. Thanks again for listening to this episode, and I hope to hear from you soon. 